And now Storm Tracker weather with meteorologist Michael Ottovino. A windy close to the work week across most of eastern Idaho. Wind advisory in effect for the areas shaded in yellow, including the Snake River Plain, the Arco Desert, and the Magic Valley as well. We could see wind gusts up to 50 miles per hour. And be aware of that for today. If you will be traveling along the interstates, you could encounter dangerous crosswinds, especially for high-profile vehicles and also areas of blowing dust. This advisory does begin at 12 o'clock today. Winds for the most part to start off the morning generally calm to a light breeze across the Snake River Plain. Looks like the breeziest spots right now are across Dubois and Twin Falls to start off the morning. But we could see sustained winds later on this afternoon between about 20 to 30 miles per hour. Additionally, with the wind for today, it's a bit chilly this morning. We are seeing temperatures in the 30s. 35 right now across Idaho Falls. Also 35 in Rexburg. We're at 39 in Pocatello. And temperatures really won't rise too much. Yesterday we saw the 60s out there. Today, high temperatures only in the 40s and 50s. So for today, definitely grab the jacket and also grab the umbrella. We're already starting to see a band of showers appearing across the Arco Desert and the Magic Valley. So some of those showers will make their way across the Snake River Plain and the western half of Wyoming as we move throughout the day. And even for the higher elevations, we could even see some snow mixing in with that at times. Giving you a wider view again, this this cold front that is kind of bisecting Idaho right now will slowly start to make its way and push towards our area, which will bring us the windier conditions and also that moisture. This is round one of the moisture just located west of Pocatello. And then we have round two located across parts of Nevada. So that's what we'll be tracking for today. Lots of wind, periods of showers at times, and also cooler temperatures. Notice these high temperatures are about 15 degrees cooler compared to what we saw yesterday. We'll be at 50 today for Idaho Falls, 51 across Rexburg, 52 degrees this afternoon in Pocatello for the Central Mountains. Rain and snow is likely as we move throughout the day. Definitely be aware of some slick spots across the mountain passes. High temperatures also in the 40s. 47 today for Salmon, 46 for Chalice, 47 across Mackey. And for the highlands in western Wyoming, the same is true for your area. Rain and snow likely throughout the day with high temperatures in the 30s and 40s. 39 today for Yellowstone, 45 for Jackson, 43 across Island Park. And timing out those winds for you again, starting at 12 o'clock, starting to turn breezy and then windy for this afternoon. Notice wind speeds around 24 miles per hour for Pocatello around 4 o'clock. And that's when we could see those 50 mile per hour gusts later on this afternoon. Also into the early evening hours as well and even into the first half of the overnight. It will generally be breezy and we could see a few lingering showers at least across the Snake River Plain and the highlands in western Wyoming. And then for the overnight conditions at least for the Snake River Plain will turn partly cloudy but temperatures will be a bit cooler tonight in the teens and 20s. Your Southeast Idaho Chevy dealers 7 day forecast leaves us partly cloudy for tomorrow to start off our weekend. It will be dry across Pocatello, 56 on Saturday, so it will be a bit chilly out there, and then well, temperatures will be in the lower 60s for Sunday with plenty of sunshine and temperatures warming into the lower 70s by Tuesday. Then our next front comes through. That'll drop temperatures substantially by Wednesday. Across Idaho Falls, your seven-day forecast, rain likely for today. Periods of partly cloudy skies for tomorrow. Lots of sunshine for Sunday. For the Teton area, Jackson, Afton, and Driggs. Expect rain and snow for today. Chance of snow showers tomorrow. And for the Central Mountains, expect rain and snow for today with a chance of some snow showers tomorrow.